Hello everyone and welcome back to episode 76 of the full game walkthrough. Today we're going to be getting access into the outer yard. And to do that, first we have to go into this tower and I'm assuming to fight a boss to get actual access in there. The gate's already open though. So I don't know why we can't just walk up in there, but more or less we got to go in here. Of course there's some kind of ice in here. You are no knight, but you, you are. A knight of the weird. Imagine that, like seeing wings on a pig. Well, come on then. I have the sharp axe and these hard horns. Let's see what you can no, do. No, should I honestly just say screw it? You know, yeah. We just need to go for it. Who cares if they're ice at this point? We can just, yeah, 1900, we should be able to deal with that. Just go ahead and put on our normal blade here. Our pet blade, excuse me. We should have an easy time here. It's storm though, so it might do a little bit of damage to us. And of course, as long as they don't use the two dreaded spells that I don't want to see uh, or even mention, we should be fine here. Minus 15. We're not going to be hitting anytime soon, so we're good there. You know, it does feel kind of lame not being able to get a spell or any, any new spell quests. I mean, I know there was the one for 75 and 70, but who cares about those? I mean, like, the Lord of Winter. That's what I want, and I want it now. Too bad we have, what is it, nine more levels to get it, though? But we should be getting um, more star spells, I think pretty soon and then our sharpened blade and potent trap actually or are those at level 88 also it's either 86 or 88 can't even remember but that's gonna be a big level for us and I don't even know why I'm mentioning it at this point let's go ahead and enchant our mammoth and then we can throw on our feints Does Storm even have access to minus 15s? Let's go ahead and throw on our normal feints. And then we can hit this next turn. I believe the Fortify is going to be up then. Yeah. Let's go ahead and use our Frost Giant. Let's see if we can get an easy dub here. He does have enough pips to use a certain something. And this might actually do like 750. I'm just taking guesses at this point. Ah, 650 basically. I was off by 100. Alright, I'm okay with that. I was worried about a Leviathan. So I'll take a Triton. Now let's see if we can actually kill here. Three blades, is that enough to get through the resist? We crit, did we crit through? Perfect. That is perfect. I think we would have actually killed even if we didn't crit on the minion. So there we go. I'm but one blade in a pin dragon storm of sorts. The rest will tear you down. Easy. Let's go. Now we get access into the outer yard, which was already open. Let's go ahead and grab this wisp real quick. Or not. I guess I guess it doesn't want us to. There we go. First time entering this area, even though we were basically there. Ooh, hold up. What was all this? Alright. Now, I don't know how long we actually the stayed of here, the though. Dragon, the evil lord of the wild hunt, have sacked this place and taken it for their own. But you see a few kind faces peering out from hiding. Over there, a brave stable hand waves for Where the hell? You. Where are we seeing this? Oh, there. 
Okay. Quickly, over here. You don't want to let them catch sight of you. You do not look like a oh. knight loyal to good Queen Gwendolyn. Whoops. You need to get to Lake Nimui? I can help you do that. I swear, what's up with the dialogue volume? We'll need the help of Sister Constance. She's in the prison tower. Can you free her? Alright, I'm guessing this is going to be another boss. Either that or a minion fight. Hopefully we can actually get away with that. Let's run in. If not, then this episode is just going to be purely just boss fights. I feel like I remember the outer yard going by pretty fast. Then again, it's been a little bit since I've gone through. What funny creature here you are. Boss fight. What you here for? Not to fight. <laughs> Maybe it does look like we're going to have to go upstairs or something. Not to crush so. your toes. <laughs> All right. Um 11k will be fine. I forgot that he's myth. Hopefully he can get all of his pips out of the system. But I actually should have used the regular blade at that point. Now we can just focus on everything else. Uh, get rid of the blizzard. We're not gonna need that. There's our TC blade. Let's use. Let's use the TC blade actually. Although it didn't really matter which one we used. I like gold. All right. Um, there's another regular blade. Do we let's discard the faint? There's our faint. Throw that on. I feel like these fights are just gonna get boring at this point. And let, I mean, if we if everything goes smoothly, they should be boring fights. But sometimes they don't. Just like this time, probably. Am I gonna call it? Oh. Okay, no, no, no. This is, he's been great to us so far. No Medusas or Quakes. And I probably shouldn't shouldn't have said that because he literally can Quake if he gets a Power Pip both turns. So now we just gotta hope for the best. Please. Oh, I don't think he's going to... Please use all your pips. Okay. Now we're safe from a from a quake, so we don't have to worry about that. We can just focus on hitting. And I think the minion's life. So we don't even yeah, we don't even have to worry about him. Easy fight all around. Now are we gonna be able to get to the the Lady of the Lake this episode or no? They're even gonna pass for us, which means we probably fizz nope, okay. Now, if we don't kill, though. I feel like I rely too much on this. I mean, we did kill. But I don't even know if... Like, is that a crit through or no? Oh, stone on the other side again. Wow. That's perfect. It's like I didn't even have to farm for that. That's probably what I said the last time, too, though. Alright, it's a good thing we don't have to fight anyone else, we can just run in here. Oh, it's this person! Okay. Thank you, kind wizard. I can see Gwendolyn shows well when she found you. Let's go tell Warwick what you've done, hmm? Yeah, how much XP do we even get here? We're almost level 80. About halfway to it. So that's exciting. Hype for level 80. I feel like we've come such a long way up until this point. And in only 76 episodes, so we're essentially getting to, we're, we're slowing down. So, um, we're still over a level an episode, but I, I feel like we're getting a level maybe every other episode here. 
So we might have to speed that up. Oh, let's grab this chest. And sneaking by me. Thank the stars you got her out safely. Sister Constance was the queen's confidant and advisor, and is very wise. She'll help us figure out how to get you to Lake Nemui. All right. I refuse to help the Pendragon or to give him any information about Gwendolyn. Thus, he had me locked up and forgotten. Queen Gwendolyn is rallying the Knights of the Silver Rose? Splendid! We should help by weakening the forces of the Wild Hunt. Defeat a hand or more of those six rocket guards. Okay, technically we already fight these guys. Um, oh, excuse me, fought. So I will be right back. All right, we're done with the six. Your battle skills are exemplary. I've not seen anyone fight so well since Artorius's last days. We need to strike another blow. If we can scatter their steeds from the stables, we'll give our troops a major advantage. I can tell Warwick has an idea by the gleam in his eye. Do I look like I just had a great idea to get the steeds out of the stable without harming them? The king had a magic hunting horn that would compel the Whitehearts to follow the music. I think it might still be in the broken tower, though a hideous black cap resides within. Of can course. you get it? Another boss. Let's go. How many bosses do you think there would be? So there's one there. We definitely have to get in there at some point. There's no way there's going to be there. Yeah, there, there's a sigil there too. Well, we're going to have to get a squire too. Alright, let's go. So let's try and throw in our TCs before I forget. I do that a lot. Death, so we treasures. boost. Yeah. Easy. I'm going to chew you up and spit you up. What's up with them and always wanting to eat us? Alright, let's go ahead with our regular blades. Just another boring boss fight. Doesn't look like anything interesting. I mean, are they at least going to cheat on us yet? What bosses actually start to cheat? Wait, hold up. Was that a was that a crit block? Since when do we do that? Okay, let's see here. Is that our... We already have that, so let's get rid of that. Um, no? Sure, I guess we'll we'll use this. I wanted a, a blade, but I guess we'll go ahead and put a feint on. Honestly, because of boost, we might be able to get away with just double feint, double blade. We might. I also probably shouldn't get too cocky though. We know what happens when that happens, I guess. For lack of a better word. Um, let's see. We have to put a blade on. Well, I guess we'll just go for the faint then. If we draw it. Where is it at? There we go. Rank 12? When did they start being rank 12? Is it in this area? Or have I just missed the change? Oh, they do use um, Fortify. Crazy. Oh, 
Yeah, we definitely didn't need one of those faints, I don't think. Ah, that left the bad taste I can't seem to get rid of. You collect the hunting horn from the black cat's nest of treasure. The horn is a gorgeous piece of craftsmanship. I need to look up where the crows are. I still haven't found them. How many do I have left? Uh, Kerleon, the wild, the weird, Dundara, outer yard. So there is one here in Lakeshore. You got it. I hope to be as brave as you when I get bigger. If you take the hunting horn into the stable and play it, you we're can over tell halfway, so maybe we'll get. Floor. You take a deep breath Whoops. and raise the horn to your lips. Maybe we'll get it the level. It sounds a great call, infused with power and grace. As the last note fades, the white hearts magically vanish. You're pretty sure you sent them to the forest near Caliburn. I could hear you from here. Now the Knights of the Silver Rose will be able to ride into battle against the Horned Ones. Tell Sister Constance what a great deed we accomplished. Bravo, Knight. Now it's time to get serious. Who we gotta fight the this time? The gate to Lake Namui is closely guarded. We must cause a big distraction. Go into the castle library and return. Oh, I was hoping we were gonna set something on fire, or explode it. something. That would be cooler. Why couldn't we just go in there and like light something on fire, causes a huge explosion, and then we run through the gate? Oh wait, that happens in Chrysalis, doesn't it? Whoops. Okay. Good news is no boss. The Book of Armaments is a heavy tome, detailing a history of weapons and warfare. It has lots of pictures of sharp things. Okay. Oh, wait. What? Whoops. I didn't mean to do that. I didn't know this was an actual battle. Three, two, one. Come on, come on, please. Thank you. <gasps> Excuse me? Hold up. What if I quit? Is it still going to pull me back in? Please don't pull me back. Uh... Okay. I'm not going that way again. Armaments chapter 2 verses 9 to 21 and sister Attila raised the pomegranate up on high saying Oh Sacred spiral bless this pomegranate that with it thou mayest blow thy enemies to tiny bits in thy mercy Excuse sister me Attila? No, it's not a common name for a girl. Oh, why do you ask? We need to get a sacred pomegranate from the royal garden, but the gates are locked fast. There is another still loyal to Gwendolyn, <gasps> Billy. And King Artorius. Find Squire Billy. He'll know how to get into the royal garden. Okay, let's avoid that at freaking all cost. Come on, Billy, what you got for us? Oh, he's so cute. Look at him. Life isn't easy from the queen's side. I feel like I'm down in the hole, but some emotions are hard to hide. Can I help you? The key to the royal garden is held by the great horned knight, one of the Pendragon's champions. He's in the Sworn Tower. Oh, so it's not this one. Okay, so... Hold up. What is this? I'm not gonna be heading in there. Right, let's go in here. So, can we just go in there already? Or wait, no, no, no. That's the actual. Yeah, no, that's the final dungeon, isn't it? <laughs> it me great Hold up a second. Welcome you to the Sworn Tower, Knight of the Weird. Right. By the horned crown, I swear I will honor you by mounting your head upon the wall there. Hold up a second. Yeah, the keep it Gandalin. That's the the last battle, right? Has to be, I think. So please tell me this is the last area then. Fizz, cool. All right. 
No, don't you do it, sir. Just cast uh, a rain of fire. I like that spell. That'll be fine. Okay. But he still has enough pips, though. Imagine if that was Burning ra Rampage, though. I can't even speak. What's up with me every single day? Yeah. Just... Crit block? That's rare. Let's actually get rid of that. Go ahead. Now, sir, if you could please just rain a fire all of your pips away, that would be much appreciated. Um, I guess it's better than than the other thing, so I'll take it. Right, let, let's just use a regular faint. I think we'll be good to hit. So this guy has her pomegranate. Is, is that what we came here for? I wasn't even listening. All I know is there was something about a pomegranate and some sister. You know what? Let's just go for it. We do boost, and last time that we boosted on the death, we didn't need two faints. So let's hope it's the same situation here. Aw, oh, shit. Do we have a blizzard? We discarded the blizzard. No. It's fine. He's dead next turn. Alright. Reindeer Knight. Fit. Oh, wow. Of course. We're gonna be able to cast Mammoth the amount of times we fizz. No. Okay, we got we got lucky. With our like three percent chance to fizz, we managed to do it. I swear, these percentages are made up. They don't even work. Let's go. Alright, where's our pomegranate? <sighs> You fought well, knight. You might even reach the pen dragon before he devours you. <laughs> All right. Whoa, I ran straight into that. Excuse me, please. Thank you. You did it. Head into the royal garden. You'll have to distract the trend-kill Pantera that prowl the gardens. When you can, grab a pomegranate and take it back to Sister Constance. Okay, let's make sure not to run in there. Oh, shit. Do we actually have to... Oh, we do have to defeat one. Why can't we just run in there and grab a pomegranate? Oh, fine, let's go. This should be easy. They have low health, right? Oh no, they're ranked 12 elites. Oh, uh, they basically have 3k. Um, Ice Blade.
right. Um, we're gonna go for a frost giant. So let's blade again. Since they have so much health for a storm. I swear, Triton's one of the spells that I see the least in the game. Frost Giant. Hopefully, first try is enough. This spell I see way too much. This one, the ice one, and the fire one. Holy hell. I'm, I still have the thought. Imagine they revamp that spell and it's like a huge ass city just like right in the middle. It's so cool. I don't know if that's just me. We didn't mean kill. Let's try and draw a blizzard. Please. Please. We. Of course we didn't. Why would we? <laughs> Seriously? This guy really wants to survive. This? No. Okay. Can we just hurry up with this? Get our grapefruit? Or pomegranate, whoops. Where that? Where that? Is that really what a pomegranate? I thought pomegranates were red. Hold up, what is this? Oh, cool. I wonder what all the secret like housing items that you can get are. I know you can get the statue of Zeus, you can get the grandmother raven. I don't have a clue what anything else is though. The blessed pomegranate of Avalon will use it to blow up the armory and send <gasps> the guards running. We are going to blow something up. First shalt thou raise the blessed pomegranate, then shalt thou count to three. No more, no less. Three Are we going shall now? be the number thou shalt count, and the number of the counting shalt be three. Once the number three be reached, yes, let's go. Thy let's go. Blessed pomegranate of Avalon towards thou foe, the armory who shall snuff it. Where's that? Where am I throwing it? Right here? You wind up to throw, and on the count of three, you hurl the pomegranate through the window. Quite the explosion from a piece of fruit. Look, the guards have fled. We couldn't have had a plan before, or like after we did that? Like, can we not just run through the gate or something now? Like the little back way? Like over, over, over here or something? Did you see the look on their faces? <laughs> what a miracle! We're now very close to level 80 now. Overlook Tower. Inside is a lever to open the portcullis that leads to Lake Nemui. However, you'll probably have to thrash the spiny spriggan who Excuse hangs me. out inside. Why? Another boss? You know, I feel like I remember all these bosses, but like... Hey, excuse me? You couldn't have taken one out. Like, hold on. We can't just, like, flip a lever and run through. We got two fossils. Nice. I know that's what we use. Did you make that big boom Ice? outside? And balance? Excuse me? So I think I'll rip yours off. Fair. Alright. 
We'll just do that and go in. All right. Um, before anything happens, throw on the prism. I'm fine with this. Yeah, this spell actually looks kind of cool, though. It's too bad it sucks. Let's go. Next round. Oh, we didn't go first. Well. Now we should be able to start our blades. We'll, we'll keep this prism because I know we're probably going to run into some kind of issue. I mean, it's a balance and an ice. Something bad's going to happen. Let's actually draw. Oh, cool. We got our TC blade for next turn. Don't you do it? That's fine. As long as there aren't any weaknesses. Damn, we're already that low? What did they do to us? <sighs> and we didn't even get it. Hold on. There we go. Don't you do it. Ooh, they were about to test my patience. I guess we have to do this at this point. Just get as much. Ooh, hold up a second. They did not. They didn't just do this. I guess I have to. Oh, don't you dare. What for? Why? Why do you have to be this way? Please at least do, like, more than half the health. Please? It's more than half, I'll take it. Uh, the only bad thing is the, the minion's still alive at more than half. Um, hold up a second. Do we reindeer knight? Yeah, let's just go ahead and do that. I know it's not going to kill her. But we can put a prism on whenever it's all done. And then go ahead with a uh, frost giant if we have to.
Okay, please at least kill minion. That did 79 damage. The bright side, minion's dead. Not so bright side. I'm gonna have to wait two more turns before I can actually put a prism on. Um, in which case, it's blade. Probably gonna have to put a mammoth on. Why is this the one battle that's taken the most, well, not not exactly the most health, but the most patience, to be honest? And, and we probably didn't even need that, but how many more ticks is left on here? Like two more? I guess we'll just pass. Okay, so now we can go ahead and throw our prison one. Hopefully I didn't get the timing wrong. And then next turn, we actually have Mammoth. So that is absolutely perfect. Unless they decide to do something. Hopefully not, I can't stand this battle any longer. Mammoth, for the first time in a while. Alright, there we go. And now we have access to the lake shore! Oh, me ringing head! Finally! Right? Don't we, don't we just flip a lever? There it is. You hear a low grinding outside. Let's hurry up. Like Fun. a gate being raised. This is the best area of Avalon. I, I'm not even sure if it is. I think it's actually one of the worst, but I don't care. Oh, we have to talk to her first, really? That's kind of lame. We can't just run through. Well done! You are a brave and virtuous knight, to be sure. With your help, I've no doubt we'll overthrow the Pendragon. Go through the portcullis and down the steps to reach Lake Shore. I've heard the Pendragon's evil servants are out in force, but I'm sure you'll find good folk loyal to the Lady of the Lake. Okay, so we're actually just going to go in there, and that's going to be the end of the of this episode. i got to slow it down, or else uh, my mouth won't be able to handle mo what my brain's coming up with. So let's just run through and get a taste of the lake shore and what next episode's going to be like. You climb down the steep Here it is. To reach lake shore. Definitely one of the coolest areas of Avalon, evil though. presence squatting over the sacred waters. Over yonder, you see someone... Dressed in simple hermit's robes. He looks injured. Alright, we'll help him in the next episode. He can suffer a little bit longer. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Make sure to join the Discord down in the description. There's going to be a link. Uh, to be honest, we don't really do much in there. But uh, if you just want to go down there, chill, or maybe start conversations, perfect for you. And thanks for watching this video.